Behind the Wrist. Today I'm talking about the solo from one of our songs, The Spirit, and The Spirit was one of the first songs that we released as a band, as Harriet. Um, we released it I think a couple of years ago now, and it was kind of dipping our toe into what we wanted our band to sound like. This solo is inspired by some of my favourite guitarists and trying to put all of their kind of techniques into something that I could try and make my own. So my favourite guitarist is Mark Morton, but I also love Kurt Ballou and Van Halen and even players like Mark Tremonti and, and trying to have all of their styles into um, my kind of thinking when I approach a solo. So especially with the dive bombs and things like that, I try and lean on like old, older thrash or like um, original kind of thrash vibes. A technique that I've used in this solo is a technique which I think is called two-hand two harmonic. Could be fourth harmonic, I'm not too sure if I'm being totally honest. Uh, but it's kind of like a Van Halen thing. Um, and I really enjoy doing that because I feel as though it brings something fresher to the solos. Um, you know, it's bringing kind of like a 90s, uh, 80s, 90s vibe um, to our sound, which is more of a modern metal approach. Um, so I really like trying to blend those two worlds, especially with solos, but in the rest of our riffs as well. Um, just because that's kind of where I started getting into guitar and metal specifically, I like to try and like home, home back in on those roots. <laughs> Like writing solos and writing music in general I kind of draw inspiration from a lot of different players um, even though obviously the biggest influences on me have been metal guitarists I'm really into blues players like Joe Bonamassa as well and those kind of players introduced me to wanting to play the instrument so much um, but the phrasing of blues is something that I've tried to hold in my solo writing and trying not to just play as quick as possible, trying to make like phrases. And I write my solos a little bit uh, more methodically. Uh, I don't just record it and, and uh, go with the whole solo. I'll think about it bit by bit and then I'll go for a full take once I've got in my head each individual bit. But I feel as though the phrasing in blues has kind of taught me to, to approach writing in that way. I've just done a full playthrough of De Spirit on Jackson's YouTube. If you want to check it out, you can head to their channel and it's available there. <laughs> 